So I believe you have already upgraded yourself to monetary, but finding out it running slow was not so expected, right? All right, you don't need to worry because we have got some good troubleshooting tips for you. To speed up your macOS monetary, watch this video to the end. So before we explain the fixes, you need to find out the reasons behind the slowdown of Mac. So first you should check if your Mac is actually compatible with macOS monetary or not. As a general rule, Macs released before 2012 are not compatible with the macOS monetary. If your Mac does not fall in such a category, then it will run slow by itself. Now we know that macOS monetary already come with good features like FaceTime upgrades, Safari revamp, privacy upgrades, live text and much more and you just don't want to miss them. This is why here are some fixes you are looking for. Checking disk space. So I'll start with checking your disk space. It's clear out here. If your disk space doesn't have free space within, you will encounter many issues including freezing and stalling. For this, click the Apple menu icon at the top. Go to about this Mac and select storage. This step will show you how much storage space is available in your system and you can easily decide if you want to optimize the downloads folder. We would also like to give you a smart tool here which can easily do optimization and easy management and that is clean up my system. The reason why clean up my system can do wonders for you are that it cleans and optimize your Mac in one go, improve your Mac's startup time, helps completely uninstalling apps, manage your Mac's disk space and secure web data privacy. Try disabling auto startup items. Programs that automatically start whenever your Mac is turned on can cause your Mac to slow down as they use background resources. To disable them, go to Apple menu, system preferences and user and groups. Choose your username and login items. Press the lock icon and enter your admin password to make changes. Here click any items from the list and press the underscore button to remove them. Simple as that. Reset PRAM or NVRAM. PRAM parameter random access memory holds information about your Mac control settings, but newer Macs no longer use PRAM. Instead, they use NVRAM non-volatile random access memory which controls your startup disk, time zone, kernel panics and volume settings. To reset them, shut your computer down, wait for a moment and turn it back on. Hold down the option command PR keys, release keys after you hear the startup sound and it's done. Resetting SMC The SMC looks after things like battery management, thermal management, keyboard lightning and more. In order to do a quick reset, shut your Mac down, hold the left side control option keys with the right side shift. After 7 seconds, add the power button. Now wait for another 7 seconds and release the keys. Finally, press the power button once again to turn your Mac on as usual. Check your Wi-Fi connection. This might seem a very obvious thing to you, but trust me, it is an important one. Check your Wi-Fi once again today and find it your internet connection is stable or not. That's it for the day guys. If you are still experiencing problems with macOS monetary and it's running slow, then you can choose to clean the whole install by getting back to factory settings while removing all customizations, user accounts, preferences, third-party apps, personal files and data. Make sure that you catch back all the data in hand before moving ahead.